Hello guys, welcome to Vidich Academy. In this section, we are going to discuss about intercepts. So, let us consider a straight line L on a coordinate plane. So, this is the line L which intersects x-axis at the vertex A with the order pair A, 0 and the y-axis at B, 0, B. Then, A, B are respectively called as the x-intercept and the y-intercept of the line L. So, depending upon these values of A, B, the position of the line AB will be discussed. So, as here A is greater than 0 and B is also greater than 0, then we can say that the line AB lies in quadrant 1. And then coming to the second condition where the x-intercept A is less than 0 and the y-intercept B is greater than 0. Then in this case, the line AB will be in this position and we can say that the line AB lies in the quadrant 2. And similarly, for the condition where the x-intercept A is less than 0 and also B is less than 0, then this will be the position of the line in quadrant 3. And the next condition where A is greater than 0 and B is less than 0, then the line AB lies in quadrant 4. And make a note that any straight line passes through the origin 0, 0 if and only if the x-intercept and the y-intercept of the straight line are both equal to 0. And then the x-intercept of a horizontal line is not defined and similarly the y-intercept of the vertical line is not defined. So this was a basic introduction regarding intercepts. In our next video, we are going to discuss about slope-intercept form. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.